you have to go to your local Target or grocery store that sells this and buy this. It's so good. Hi everyone. I have a wedding to go to tonight, so I'm gonna do a get ready with me. This morning I went to a spin class and then I showered and self-tanned afterward and um, then I ran a bunch of errands. Went to Ulta, got a bunch of new goodies. I went to a store downtown to pick up my dress that I'm wearing for tonight. So it's been a little bit of a chaotic day. Winnie is passed out next to me, so wish I could do the same. I tried to rest my eyes for like 20 minutes, but I did not fall asleep, so. I will link everything down below product-wise because there's no way I'm going to remember to share each product with you. So I'll link everything down below in order that I used it. Also, I rinsed myself tan off and decided to pick up my face after I got out of the shower. So very disappointed in myself for that. Oh, I feel like this day has gone by so fast. I woke up pretty early too, so I don't know why it feels like it's going so fast. I'm gonna do a little Ulta haul here as well. I literally have to do my nails still. I'm just a hot mess. So anyway, I got some pimple patches. Oh my God, this dog is crazy upstairs. I got this Vintage Rose Morphe palette. Kiss Press On Nails. Kristen S. Workable Hairspray. A white eyeliner. The Tarte Maracuja Juicy Lip Plump in Mixed Berry. And the same product, but in White Peach. So, oh, easily spent $100 just on a bunch of miscellaneous products, so oops. I'm going to the wedding of the girl who used to do my lashes, her name's Taylor. Her and I are actually friends as well, so she does like facials, waxes, um, brows, lashes, but she does a lot of stuff. She has her own little private booth. I used to go to her for lashes before I took a break from getting them. I will be going to Mexico in March, so I think I might get them again before I go on vacation because it's just so much easier to have lashes and I just feel so much more like confident with them because I don't wake up looking like a little blonde naked mole rat. <laughs> my hair is obviously very very light so my eyelashes are very light as well so I just like having lash extensions just because you know I can wake up and just be ready but I took a break from them because I had them on for over a year so I needed a little bit of a break. I want to talk about my little dress situation. So I ordered this dress from Target and I was going to wear it and it was this longer silky like midi dress with a little slit up the side and it was so cute and I'm trying to think of what the back looked like. I think it was just like a silky cowl neck type of vibe and then the back had like an extra string to keep the straps together. I'll put a picture right here but trying it on it wouldn't fit over my butt. So I had to rush to find something else. I ordered a dress from this little boutique called Kitsona and I did not like it. It was not cute on me. It looked really cute on the model, but she was also like seven foot 10 and I am like five foot two or five foot three. So I'm very short and things don't look the same on me. So I had to rush to find a dress. Last night I ordered one for pickup from another local store called Proper. So. I haven't tried this one on yet, so fingers crossed that it fits and looks okay because I have no other options. So, <laughs> there's that. I look like a ghost. I used my darkest foundation. I am on the Hot Mess Express today. I also just got back from Arizona, which was really fun. I visited my friend Brittany and stayed with my friend Chaney, which you guys might know Chaney from some vlogs. And I'm sure you know Brittany as well. I met Brittany through YouTube. Her and I have been friends for years. I don't even know like the years specifically, but her and I have been friends for a very long time and love them both. I haven't posted that vlog yet, but it'll be up before this one probably. We had so much fun except for the night that I went out for Halloween. I was pretty much sober. I had had two drinks while getting ready for the night and it was literally like 11 o'clock at this point. So like four or five hours later, I was about to get into a bar and we were trying to find Cheney's sister and the guy was basically convinced that my ID was fake. And I'm from North Dakota, if you guys don't know, but he was literally like, this is fake. This is a fake ID. And I'm like, oh my God. I'm like, no, it's not. Like, this is my ID. So it is what it is. Like, 
can't do anything about it now but they were like convinced that it was fake and they weren't going to give it back so i was like well how am i supposed to get on my flight i was panicking very upset i'm 26 and i've never had that happen to me so yeah i almost got my id taken away so that was fun <laughs> not at all but anyway we made it home i am such a grudge holder too so i like never let things go and I think about them all the time, like I just let it eat me alive. So apologies to Chaney and Brittany for having to listen to that again. This dog upstairs is literally like, hopefully the camera's picking it up, but I should not have picked in my face. I was doing so well for the longest time with not picking up my skin. And then of course, right before I have to go to a wedding, I choose to demolish my pimples. And they like weren't even pimples, they were just like there. And then I squeezed them and game over. I've literally looked for these glasses like everywhere and one day I was just randomly at I think it was home goods and I found them and they were just like sitting on a shelf two of them so I bought them so I can't really link those I'll try to find something I don't really know what the like texture of them is called like tortoise shell like I don't really know this is usually like my good side like the pic the side I like in pictures so that was such a stupid move. Why did I do that? I'm mad at myself. Also, have you guys ever used these Kiss Impress color stick on nail things? I had really like never heard of them until one of my coworkers mentioned them to me and she uses them quite often. I don't usually use like press on nails since I work in the healthcare field, but I'll probably take these off tomorrow. My friend Chaney also said she really likes them. So I am excited to try them tonight i'm usually really hard on my nails so like even gel chips i'm really bad oh and he's dreaming i can't believe christmas things are already out in like full force I don't ever remember like stores going as crazy as they do in the past. Like Target already has a ton of Christmas stuff out. I feel like Halloween stuff was out in like August. I don't know. I just don't ever remember things being like that, but maybe they were and I'm just not paying attention. But yeah, I just don't really remember that. can't decide if I want to do eyeshadow or not because I feel like every time I do I just doesn't like turn out how I how I want it to so then I feel like I don't like I feel like something's missing if I don't wear it I don't know that's why I like having lashes because I feel like that just like gave another like something to my face Oh my god, oh, it's already 3.36. Where did the time go? Oh my god, this blush is so tinted. Shit. Whoopsies. <sighs> Oh my gosh, this is why I don't do get ready with me because I suck at doing my makeup. I'm just like chaotic all over the place. One person's get ready with me is that I love to watch are Alex Earls on TikTok. I love her personality, but her lifestyle is like so opposite of anything close to mine. And I think that's why I like to watch it so much. This is chaos. I'm so excited to try these. I've seen them all over TikTok. Of course, I'm even surprised. Here is the palette that I bought. 
I might just do something light. I don't know. I have such hooded eyes that it like doesn't even matter if I put eyeshadow on because you can't see it unless my eyes are closed. I am craving like tacos right now. I always forget to ask you guys to ask me like questions or like topics to talk about. Everyone just wants to hear about like work stuff, so I don't know. I take my boards at the end of this month on November 29th for MRI. I'm so nervous. I will do a video once I do pass of how I studied and stuff. But yeah, this should be like my last set of boards. Thank goodness. I did my x-ray boards in July or June. I can't remember. I think it was July. I think I did my x-ray boards in like June of 2020 and then I did my CT boards in 20 in March of 2022 and now I'm doing my MRI boards in November of 2022. I have done a lot of studying for these boards and I'm very exhausted. I bought these cheap elf brushes for Halloween and then I ended up not using them because I ended up not being what I originally was going to be. I don't know what I'm doing. I always forget that I'm doing a get ready with me when I actually am doing them and then I just like forget to talk, so sorry. I'm like trying to just concentrate. This looks awful. Why do I do this all the time? I'm half tempted to like take it off. Clear? What the f is clear eyeliner? What? Okay, never mind, that's not white. Well, my curling iron heats up. I'm gonna try these nails. <laughs> I feel like they're gonna be interesting. Okay. How do you do this? if you were in a pickle and don't have time to get your nails done or do them yourself literally so easy to put on I'm gonna curl my hair I was gonna do like a wand type of technique but I don't have time for that it is 4 5 I need to leave by 4 30 at the latest because the wedding starts at 5 of course I'll show you guys the dress and the shoes that I'm wearing since it is a winter wedding I feel like it's so hard to find like a winter dress that is like warm I <laughs> Just opted for a black dress, hopefully that's okay. It is a nice material. I actually was kind of nervous buying online, especially from this boutique. I bought like a romper from this boutique proper before and I literally, had, I had to get a large. Usually if I were to be ordering online, I would get a medium, but the large even was like a children's large. It was so small. So I think that brand just kind of runs a little smaller. So I was a little nervous to order from this um, online boutique and of course like, I didn't have time to just like go into the store and like browse myself. So I just did like for online pickup and ran in really fast and got it. It looks promising. It looks like it'll fit. The more I look at my eye makeup, the more I don't mind it. But I just don't know why I even try with eye makeup because you can't even see it on me. I also have a friend in town so I'm probably going to go out for drinks. Maybe with them, I don't know, we'll see. My hairdresser actually is going to the wedding tonight. One of my classmates for my x-ray program is going to be there. Oh, 
All right. I'm just gonna let it sit for a second and then I'll just run my fingers through it. I think I'm gonna get changed really quick. I don't think I'm gonna do anything else to my makeup because I'm just gonna ruin it. I do. Okay, I just brushed my teeth and now I'm gonna put on one of these lipstick gloss thingies. Um, this one is white peach. I think you just like push up. The other one is mixed berries. Here's the mixed berries one. I feel like they look really similar. I'm just kidding, no they don't. <laughs> This one's white peach, this one's mixed berries. I gotta get dressed pronto. You guys don't have a pair of these, they're like the, they don't do any like sucking in or anything, but it's just nice like not wearing just your undies underneath your dress. These are jockey, little like, almost like spandex. And here's the dress. I'm gonna go get dressed and then show you guys the finished product. I have a ginormous, gigantic mess back there, but here is how the dress came together. This I'm a little concerned about. Gonna have to do this because I have no other options. So here's my purse, it's from Abercrombie. Phone, concealer, lip product, keys, wallet, and I'm gonna bring my other lip plumper from Too Faced. I have my rings on that I wear all the time from Ana Luisa. Necklace is from Ana Luisa. I do have these like Spanx on underneath, but I'm just like really worried because Okay, I have to go drop Winnie off. I'm going to be late if I don't do it right now. So here's the outfit and the shoes. I have to cut the tags off still. Thanks for coming along for this chaotic get ready with me. Um, I don't have time for anything else. So we're doing Brazilian bum bum.